Welcome to my YouTube channel, Knowledge Vista. Have you ever wondered how the intricate process of the menstrual cycle works within the female body? It's a monthly dance of hormonal changes, where women's bodies prepare for the possibility of pregnancy. This process is orchestrated by four key hormones, follicle stimulating hormone or FSH, luteinizing hormone or LH, alongside estrogen and progesterone. The menstrual cycle is divided into three main phases. First, the follicular phase, where FSH stimulates the growth of a follicle in the ovary. Next, ovulation, where a surge of LH triggers the release of an egg. Lastly, the luteal phase, where the remaining follicle transforms into a structure called the corpus luteum, releasing progesterone to thicken the uterine lining in preparation for a potential. The menstrual cycle is a fascinating and complex process, a testament to the incredible workings of the female body. Now that we've explained the basic structure of the menstrual cycle, let's delve deeper into each phase. So, what exactly happens during the follicular phase of the menstrual cycle? This phase is the opening act of the menstrual cycle. It kicks off on the first day of menstruation and wraps up with ovulation. During this time, the pituitary gland releases follicle-stimulating hormone, or FSH for short. This hormone encourages the growth of several follicles in the ovaries, each one housing a potential egg. Meanwhile, these follicles are not just sitting idle. They're busy producing estrogen, a hormone that prepares the uterus for a possible pregnancy. As one dominant follicle emerges, we transition into the next part of the story, ovulation. Here's where luteinizing hormone, or LH, steps onto the stage. A surge in LH triggers the release of the mature egg from the dominant follicle. This grand exit from the follicle is known as ovulation. Now that we've covered ovulation, what happens during the final phase of the menstrual cycle? Finally, let's discuss the luteal phase, the last stage of the menstrual cycle. This phase commences following ovulation and concludes with menstruation. During this period, the ruptured follicle undergoes a transformation into what is known as the corpus luteum. This structure plays a vital role, releasing progesterone, a hormone that thickens the uterine lining, preparing it for a potential pregnancy. However, if the egg released during ovulation doesn't get fertilized, the corpus luteum degenerates. As a result, progesterone levels take a nosedive and this leads to the shedding of the thickened uterine lining, a process we know as menstruation. This marks the beginning of a fresh cycle. And so we've journeyed through the fascinating process of the menstrual cycle and ovulation, an incredible symphony of hormones and bodily changes. Remember, understanding your body is the first step towards maintaining your health.